I wanted not to say much except the oath, but I have to say this. I strongly endorse Bill de Blasio's core campaign commitment that we have to have a city of shared opportunities, shared prosperity, shared responsibilities. We are interdependent. Look around. We can't get away from each other. We have to define the terms of our dependence. The mayor is taking the oath on a Bible once used by President Franklin Roosevelt. It is altogether appropriate that he should do this. Please raise your right hand, state your name, and repeat after me. I, Bill de Blasio. I, Bill de Blasio. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the State of New York. The Constitution of the State of New York. In the Charter of the City of New York. And the Charter of the City of New York. And that I will faithfully discharge. And that I will faithfully discharge. The office, the duties of the office of mayor of the city of New York. The duties of the office of the mayor of the city of New York. According to the best of my ability. According to the best of my ability. So help me God. So help me God. Thank you. Now, of course, I know that our progressive vision isn't universally shared. Some on the far right continue to preach the virtues of trickle-down economics. They believe that the way to move forward is to give more to the most fortunate, and that somehow the benefits will work their way down to everyone else. They sell their approach as the path of rugged individualism, but Fiorello LaGuardia, the man I consider to be the greatest mayor this city has ever known, he put it best. He said, I too admire the rugged individual, but no rugged individual can survive in the midst of collective starvation. So please remember, we do not ask more of the wealthy to punish success. We do it to create more success stories. 